the Joe Rogan experience. Travel and ass. It's it's also weird. Like what will accept people dying from? Like uh, I was listening to this podcast where uh, this wolf lady. She's a wolf biologist. She was talking to my oh. friend Steve Ranella on the Meat Eater podcast. Mm -hmm. And they, she was talking about how we accept people getting killed by mountain lions. Yeah. Like, it's, it happens. It mm -hmm. happened twice last year. Right. It happens. It's not, it's not really common, but it happens. But the moment that people start getting killed by wolves in America, people are going to get furious. Really? Yeah, because they reintroduced wolves oh, in that's 1994. Right. That's right. Oh, so, that, so that's... Uh, <laughs> They're outraged that we did that too. Yeah. Well, she was basically. There were it was. There was two really interesting things about the podcast. A, a lot of really interesting things, but two that really stood out was one that the these people they they reintroduced these animals in 1994, but there were already some wolves here. Yeah. And the wolves would have probably em eventually made it down there. It was in Yellowstone, right? <clears throat> yeah. 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 But that we aren't we, because the fact that they brought them in. And it wasn't just a natural fixture. Oh. We have this thing like, oh, somebody ruined this. Yeah. Somebody fucked this up. Yeah. And the other thing is that they number them instead of name them. Mm -hmm. Because if you name them, it's like, <laughs> oh, there's Dolores. Oh, Dolores killed some sheep. We're going to have to take her out. No, right. we can't kill Not Dolores. Not Dolores. What yeah, number three. Wolf 157. Right. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. It's like inmates in prison. You just give them numbers. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So it's easier to kill them. Easier to treat them like cattle. Right. So, but we did the one guy killed that mountain lion. He fought back. Yeah, right? that story That's turned one. out to be horseshit. Oh, is that right? Yeah, that the oh. mountain lion was. Uh, it was a, a kitten. It was a kitten. Yeah, it was a real kitten, and it had been separated from its mom. I think his mom got killed, <clears throat> and it was really, really small and really young. Oh. So it wasn't like. I mean, he might attack yeah. it. Who knows? It was oh, emaciated. Right. Yeah. Well, he still Maybe got fucked up a, a little bit. Yeah, and he's a bitch. I don't know. I'm just kidding. <laughs> If he's listening right now, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> yeah. But I think... Um, well, we're happy you're alive. I'm, we're happy you're alive. You better not touch wolves, buddy. I think it, it maybe it was starving to death and it took a chance to try to kill him. Yeah. That's possible, too. But it was really small. It was like yeah. 30 pounds. Which still, a 30-pound cat is fucking terrifying. I never saw pictures of the, the cat, uh, the one no, that I he killed. No, I never saw it either. Because so, I think something had ate a lot of it by the time... Oh, okay. Yeah. Let's, so did he say how he did it? Did he put it in like a chokehold or did he... I think he said stab he, it with he a, choked it. Oh. Right? Stepped on it. Something like that. Oh man, yeah. I was gonna ask if you saw this thing going around the internet about this uh, wolf pack being tracked. Or there's actually six of them. It's like a moving GIF over time, but. Um, oh yeah, I have seen this. It's amazing. It shows how they never cross territories. <gasps> yeah. Oh, cool. Six different packs, I would think. Yeah, they all establish their territory. They mark their territory, Excellent. and and they, and they respect. They it. all respect it. Yeah. It's like over Minnesota. I think. Yeah. Minnesota has a shitload of wolves, apparently. <laughs> well, if it keeps going, and it's a, a picture of Jimi Hendrix. Wisconsin has a shit. <laughs> right, if you pull back further. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Wisconsin has a shitload of wolves, apparently. Like thousands. That's Wisconsin, no yeah. Yeah. I could see that. I mean, it's a lot of, you know, woods up there and just yeah. land. Not not many major cities. I think I saw Milwaukee. a wolf once. I think I saw a wolf once. But it was You real, mean like in the wild? Yeah. It was big. It was, a, it was either a coyote or it was a wolf, but I think it might have been a wolf because it was uh, just getting dusk and I was in uh, Alberta and I saw this thing run across the road. I was like, that might have been a wolf. Yeah. But I've if you see a one. wolf, that's the spooky thing is what are they doing? They're circling you? Yeah. They're checking you out? <laughs> and they're not it? usually alone, right? No. But those are the lone wolf, but that's rare. That's an asshole. That's <laughs> yeah. a guy who got kicked out. You ever seen this video? This one's great. No. Look at the size of this thing. It comes out of the woods. Walks across the street. Look at this. Oh my size god, of this motherfucker. Jesus. That's a bear. <sighs> that's such a big wolf. That's a bear. No, that's a wolf. I wonder what, what the that fuck weighed. is that? It's a big ass wolf. That's what that is. That's probably Damn. a 100, 130 pound wolf or something. Where is this? If I had to guess, that is looks this like Canada? Russia. Russia. Yeah, it's got to be Russia. That's a gigantic <clears throat> wolf. Russia's had real legitimate problems with wolves. Where in Siberia, they have these super packs. Uh -huh. They would get together, like, because they were starving. So they'd get, like, a hundred wolves who'd form a super pack. Because they could kind of do whatever the fuck they wanted once they got that big. Yeah. And they started killing horses. Yeah. Going to horse stables. Just yeah, tearing them apart. A bunch of wolves apart. take down a horse easy. Yeah, but it's just the idea that the super packs, uh -huh. they, they realized it was too hard to, to just take over shit. Right. With all these pesky people and their guns and houses. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
So they got desperate. We're going to take your fucking horses now. 